All right, it seems to me that cops' jobs, or no, 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 cops' duties are not exactly to have a job so much as it is that they mitigate disaster. They don't so much be proactive in trying to um, get actions done on a on a forward manner. Instead, they resolve disputes uh, between parties and it's it's kind of like what a parent does with children okay what y p cops are like an extension of parents okay so ask yourself what do parents normally do to manage their children uh, and I mean, there's there's limitations to that. The cops are like a branch of of parenting, in a way. I mean, the cops aren't there to make you do your di do dishes or clean your room, but when there's a dispute, like if a brother hits a sister, then the, the parents jump in there and and uh, try to prevent any future action from happening, and they mitigate that disaster they, they investigate uh, the reasons why the event occurred and and yeah they try to uh, prevent it from uh, occurring again in the future um, so th there's there's that uh, but being being proactive like like it's a job like they say I have a job to do well then then uh, thinking in that way you're, you're bringing your you're, you're you're creating things you're you're in this mind frame like you have to create things okay when you really you're a responder okay that's I mean emergency response you're a part of the the emergency response team just like firefighters just like just like the ambulance okay so you got the sirens and all that stuff. You're an emergency response. You're you're not exactly a, a proactive going out there and trying to to get people to arrange themselves in in ways that that make you feel better. To, that feel that feel normal. I guess you don't normally see some situation as it is. So you try to re be proactive and rearrange it. And do a job to. To, to rearrange the social situation it's it's more a matter of, of reacting to uh, the disputes and, and stuff because um, that's I mean that's what uh, the people have of called upon this this profession to be created was uh, to have a, a dispute uh, resolution. And it's unfortunate that the cops have to be the first to get called for dispute um, issues when two parties can't come to terms, can't come come to the same mind on how to uh, resolve their situation. They have to turn to cops. Uh, cops have have gone with the most extreme measures, just like going to a doctor or something. Doctors cutting drug, cops shooting arrest and um you're you're when you give cops that kind of power uh, and and they're and you get too many of them employed in one area you're gonna have more competition for business people cops will be more concerned about their keeping their jobs and stuff you gotta like think how many people do we really need to, to mitigate problems in a community? And, and some, some cities are, are worse than others. Uh, but, I mean, there's, if, if there's a particular business that's getting broken into frequently, they can hire a, a private security guard for that. And, and then that takes away from the the city police having to 
to run over there all the time. Um, the the just the uh, responsibilities that uh, cops think that that they they try to they grab for more responsibility in in a lot of situations, and and they're they're overstep their boundaries quite a bit, and and then try to be proactive and and then create a social fabric that they think in in their minds should should be how how a city uh should look and feel people should interact with each other in in certain ways and whatnot and the cops are are uh trying to embellish their their views on how a city should operate in that way and they're being proactive in in that way when really they need to listen and learn about the culture and 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 be a responder to uh, disputes more, be the mitigator.